Here at 11, President Biden fields more questions today about his student loan forgiveness plan and its impact on inflation. We are looking at how this could affect our economy and the mixed reaction that it is getting from current students and graduates. Two news reporter Allison Gens live in the studio with us on why some people are not happy with the president's decision. Allison. John Brooke, while many uh, with student loans are excited to see some of their debt forgiven, I spoke with a college graduate who says she'll qualify for President Biden's loan forgiveness program, but she believes loan holders should have full responsibility for repayment. It confuses me as to why somebody else would pay for something that I chose to do. Cedarville University alumna Jessica Morgan says she has $30,000 in federal student loan debt, but she's been working to pay that down even during the pause. I'd be preying on the principal as opposed to the interest in the principal. President Biden Friday told press his plan will not cause inflation. Instead, he says it will generate economic growth because it will free up money for Americans. Dr. Mark Clausen with Cedarville says some economists are worried it could cause the opposite result. The people who to, who benefit from this have all this new money, 500 billion potentially. It's going to inject, be injected into the economy. That's going to continue the cycle of inflation and make it worse. Clausen says there are long-term actions the Biden administration could have taken, like addressing college costs. Over the last 30, 40 years, we've had a double the increase of administrators and no change in faculty. So that means that we're having administrative bloat, which costs a bunch of money. Clausen says money for Biden's program will likely have to come from taxpayers or the country will have to borrow more, which is why Morgan says she doesn't agree with the president's actions. I go buy something, I'm expected to pay for that thing. And I don't expect other people like taxpayers or the government to pay for what I bought out of my own will. President Biden said in his remarks about his plan that he does want to ta tackle reducing college costs, including doubling the amount awarded for Pell Grants. In the studio, Allison Gens, 2 News, working for you.